Okay, so I have vastly underestimated the power of these batteries. That's the second set of batteries. This is the first set of batteries. Okay, short story. I burned out the BMS. I'll, I'll, don't bother digging a hole on what that means. I burned out the BMS on those second set of batteries that I just showed you. They, the manufacturer replaced them. Uh, which is cool. So, um, the two batteries that were on the shelf. The ones that were on the floor, uh, the BMS uh, got a little confused. And so the advice is to drain them. I've never actually tried to max out what these things can do. I've, I, I don't really have a lot that I can plug into them. So, here's what I did. I charged every single one of these. Every single one of these. I charged four of these. I charged three of these. I charged this over 50% and it is a hog. I charged this three times. I charged that. I continually charged this. And for two nights and two full days, I charged my iPhone. I used lights. I kept things running all night. I mean, all night. I charged two of these things fully, and they're a beast. They hog up a lot. I plugged in a toaster three times. I used the Ninja on high, and that still wasn't enough, so I got more creative. I tried this, <sighs> and I tried this. Not yet doing it, so I got, I got serious. I decided to use the outdoor lights and it barely made an impact. Oh my God. After two days of trying everything I can think of, I just decided to plug it all in at the same time. And it finally forced the inverter to start beeping because it's only a 750 watt inverter, but still, I barely broke 13 volts on that thing for three days, almost or two days, two nights, three days, two nights, three days, two nights. I barely broke. I couldn't even break 13 volts on that thing. Could not get it below. I'm trying to drain them. Today, I finally got it by combining all that together and being absolutely ridiculous and over the top with it. I finally got it drained down to 12 volts. It's not drained yet. It's not dead. I want it dead but it's not drained yet. It's amazing. Point being, this is a lot more solid situation than I thought it was. So it will, it will put out a lot of juice and it charges up pretty quick with the right panels. So there you go. It's hard to drain these things. Turning on the inverter. And it's kind of bright. It says 13, it says 13.9 or 12.9, 13. I have barely made an impact on this thing and you can't see that. Oh my. Let's see what this says. You can't see that. No, the battery says 12.9. So here we go. I mean, all I can do is just, I mean, the inverter overheated. That's why I had to shut it off. I've got this running. That's cool. I've got heat. And I got this light going, all at the same time. Man, these things are really robust. So if you were worried like I was about how much uh, these batteries can sustain, um, how much you can get out of them, uh, apparently you can get a lot more than I had originally anticipated or thought. So having been forced to uh, drain these things, I am now discovering that they are in fact quite robust. Um, I literally ran the Ninja, these outdoor lights, a heater, and a refrigerator before the inverter had to quit because the inverter is only 750 watts and it was overheating. But the battery is still at 12.7. I'm sitting here running on all this and it's still at 12.7. So a healthy battery uh, settles at 13.4, something like that between that and 13.8. Um, so it's getting down there, you know, it's, it's got to go below 12 and, 
um, and just die. It's no longer supply power before I'll feel like it's, um, it's, it's emptied. But hey, now you know. So all you got to do is uh, trust that um, the math is right. Remember, it's amp hours. So if you have a 100 amp battery, that's a 100 amp hour AH. That means however many amps you're pulling, um, you can divide that by how long you're running or multiply by how long you're running it and uh, divide that number. You know, you have 100 amp hours for one battery. So if you have a, uh, I mean, if you have a 10 amp device, it'll run for 10 hours, theoretically. But then, you know, you'll probably be draining it down to uh, an unhealthy status. But anyway, now you know. Hope that helps somebody.